Hey guys, how are you doing today? I got home today and I had my very first book box on my doorstep. I am super excited. This is the mystery book box by Paige Habit. Haven't looked at it, haven't anything. The moment I got home, I saw it and I got everything out so that I could film. So without further ado, let's see what is in the box. There's something loose in there, so I'm, I hope nothing's broken. Ooh, well, that was easy. Let's see. Ooh. It says, get into, oh, let's see. It says, get into the habit. Um, it says, snap, give, read. One of, the, my, one of my favorite things about Page Habit is the fact that they donate books to um, children, and uh, I think that that's, as a teacher, I think that that's absolutely fantastic. So it says, post a picture of your unboxing with the hashtag MyPageHabit tag, and we will donate another book to a child without access. And I work in a lower socioeconomic um, school district, and so I think that it's absolutely fantastic that someone, maybe even one of my kiddos, will get a free book out of this. So I get a, a Page Habit bookmark. It says, Words can be like x-rays if you use them properly. They'll get through anything. You read and you're pierced. Aldous Huxley. That is awesome. It says, greetings, gentle reader. Welcome to Watch Me Disappear. I like to describe my novel as a literary suspense about a woman who, yes, disappears. And is she really dead or not? Um, but it's also about families, identities, the stories we tell ourselves about the people we love. I hope you enjoy reading it as much as I enjoyed writing it. Happy reading. So I guess this is a note from the author. That's pretty cool. Ooh, we get a field notes, uh, sort of like journal. That's pretty awesome. Look at that. And I'm assuming that, oh, it's made in the US. Very nice and sustainable. Um, then we get sort of who they're giving their books to. This is the South Sedan snapshot. And so it's just all about summer reading, our two of our favorite words here at Page Habit. We're very excited to help you to our July boxes filled with standout books that help fuel those warm weather reading seasons ahead. And so it's got a little bit more information. That's super awesome. Oh, look, we get a, I get a little, uh, oh, a little, book light. That's super cool. I like it. It's in my favorite color. So that is awesome. And this is, it says, it says, look inside for my annotations by uh, Janelle Brown. And she goes, and forgive my terrible handwriting. I have terrible handwriting too. I'm left-handed. So anytime I write, I like drag across the ink on the page and that's not fun, but it's watch me disappear. Um, the inside says, Tom, Tom. My cat is attacking card bo cardboard boxes. Okay. Who you want people to be makes you blind to who they really are. It's been years since Billy Flanagan, a beautiful, charismatic Berkeley mom with an enviable life, went on a solo hike in desolation wilderness and vanished from the trail. Her body was never found, just a shattered cell phone and a solitary hiking boot. Her husband and teenage daughter have been coping with Billy's death the best they can. Jonathan drinks as he works on a loving memoir about his marriage. Olive grows remote from both her father and her friends at the all-girls school she attends. But then, Olive starts having strange visions of her mother still alive. Jonathan worries about Olive's emotional stability until he starts unearthing secrets from Billy's past that bring into question everything he thought he understood about his wife. Who was the woman he knew as Billy Flanagan? Together, Olive and Jonathan embark on a quest for the truth about Billy, but also about themselves, learning in the process about all the ways that love can distort what we choose to see. Brown's insights into the dynamics 
of intimate relationships will make you question what you tell yourself about the people you love, while her nervy, propulsive storytelling will keep you guessing until the very last page. That actually seems like a really good book. Um, I'm excited about it. Let's see what it looks like. Naked. Ooh, very beautiful blues, light blue and dark blue. I like that. What I think is fantastic about Page Habit is they also have a online forum on Facebook where you can get into immense discussions about all different kinds of books um, that not only do they send in their bookly boxes, but also any book that you're reading at the time. The community is so loving and I've, I've gained a lot of friends in the group. I loved the mystery book last month. I actually didn't get the box for it, but I did buy the book and it was Midnight at the Bright Ideas Bookstore by Matthew J. Sullivan. And what's awesome is that they put people as sort of like the coordinator of the live discussion about the books that, that they read. And I participated in that talking about the quirks of the books from last month and that was a lot of fun. So I'm super excited to read the annotations that the um, author actually makes in this book. If you see there's all these blue uh, post-it notes. Um, what's awesome is that the author annotates sort of what they were thinking as they wrote it and so you get to come across those as you're reading to maybe get a little bit more insight. I think that that is a fantastic way to sort of interact with your readers. It makes you feel like you're you're a part of the author's thought process and how they formed the story. So I'm super excited to read Watch Me Disappear. I might pick it up today. Who knows? I actually just finished a book last night. So this is perfect timing. Good job, Page Habit. Um, I will leave Page Habit's website down below. This is not an affiliate link, so I'm not getting anything from it. I just thought that maybe if you wanted to look at a book box that I think Page Habit is a perfect one to sort of get started on. So that's the end of this chapter of Court Tagonist. I hope that I introduced something new to you that you haven't seen before or maybe made you want to read a genre that you might not necessarily read. Um, until next time, guys. Mwah! Happy reading. Bye.